BBC Premier League update from the home of Premier League football. Hello, I'm Alistair Ross at BBC Sport and Manchester United have agreed a fee of around $97 million with Everton for striker Romelu Lukaku, senior club sources have told the BBC. The 24-year-old Belgium international scored 25 Premier League goals last season. United, who have been chasing Lukaku for most of the summer, will now not be pursuing their interest in Real Madrid's Alvaro Morata. Everton sources say no deal or agreement has been reached. The former Everton player Kevin Ratcliffe says the huge fee could allow them to target Arsenal striker Olivier Giroud as a replacement. Now, I think the players made it clear that he uh, he wants to depart and go and play Champions League football. I think it was so, so important that if he was going to go, that Everton were going to get a good fee for him. Um, this seems a, a decent enough fee. It just makes sense when you're looking to bring in somebody like uh, Giroud instead. But uh, that, that is the reason you're looking at maybe Oliver Giroud to, to come into the club. Manchester City striker Kalecci Iheanacho is in talks about a $32 million move to Leicester. The 20-year-old scored 14 goals in 35 appearances in all competitions the season before last, but was unable to find the same form during Pep Guardiola's first season as City boss, scoring seven times in 28 games. He only signed a contract extension last August that runs to 2021. And Benin international Steve Mounier says he's delighted to be playing in what he calls the greatest championship in the world. At $15 million, the 22-year-old former Montpellier forward has become newly promoted Huddersfield Town's record signing. Premier League is uh, the best championship in the world and uh, it was a dream when when I was young and, and now... I, uh, it's a goal for me. It was a goal for me, and uh, and now I'm there, and I will be uh, work very hard to to do my best in, in in this league for all the the trust we we give me. That's Steve Mounier talking to Huddersfield's official website. And for more football news from the BBC, go to bbc.com/football. BBC Premier League update from the home of Premier League football.